Virtual endoscopy is a non-invasive medical procedure for exploring parts of the human vascular system. We have developed an experimental interactive tool that takes as input data acquired with standard medical imaging modalities and regards it as a virtual environment to be interactively inspected. The system supports real-time navigation with stereoscopic direct volume rendering and dynamic endoscopic camera control, interactive tissue classification and point picking for morphological feature measurement. This short video illustrates our approach with real-time sequences showing the examination of a human carotid artery. Our aim is to merge the concepts of interactive direct volume rendering and virtual endoscopy in a tool for non-invasive visualization and analysis of diseased vessels. In our tool, a simple 2D GUI is used to map data values to emission and absorption coefficients for volume rendering. Various rendering effects can thus be achieved including either surfaces and opaque objects. The volume rendering approach is therefore more general than the surface visualization of current virtual endoscopy systems. The full potential of volume rendering is exploited when offering users real-time viewing and interaction. Here a spaceball controls the endoscopic camera. Device input is interpreted as forces and torques applied to a virtual camera model. A viscous friction field proportional to volume opacity helps to confine the camera in cavity interiors during navigation. For interactive performance, we render volumes through back-to-front slice composition, exploiting 3D texture mapping and blending hardware. Our acceleration techniques detailed in the paper include adaptive sampling and zoom rendering. The ability to render perspective stereoscopic views at interactive speeds dramatically improves depth perception and enables direct 3D interaction solutions for performing complex tests. Here, we measure the variation in lumen of the vessel by dragging a ruler whose endpoints automatically follow the interior vessel surface. Point picking with cursor following is implemented by casting rays from the 2D mouse position. To detect walls during ray casting, we use an accumulated opacity algorithm that traces the ray from front to back until the accumulated opacity is larger than the user settable threshold. By combining hardware direct volume rendering with a 3D user interface, we have created a system that aims at supporting physicians in the understanding of the precise special location and shape of vessel lesions, which is of primary importance for vascular disease treatment. Optical endoscopy is an invasive procedure possible only on drained vessels. This sequence shows the examination of the utoptic specimen of a human right carotid artery fixed while distending to restore normal in vivo morphology explanted from a cadaver of a 32 years old man died by an accident without any apparent cerebral disease. Here the same specimen is explored using interactive virtual endoscopy. The endoscopic view is generated from a 256 by 256 by 32 CT dataset at 12 bit resolution. We see a stenosis area 2 cm beyond the carotid bifurcation and interactively inspect and measure lumen variations. The sequence emphasizes that virtual endoscopy provides good 3D localization of arterial lesions and precise reconstruction of their geometry. These tests that will be soon followed by tests on actual patient data indicate that virtual endoscopy promises to be a non-invasive medical procedure that can improve diagnostic sensitivity in the vascular domain.